hi guys and welcome to today's video i am heading off to drive kate to school she's on a new semester now she goes for the afternoon she's got an online course in the morning and a spare so now we're heading in to go drive her and then i've got to go do a jewelry drop off i know you guys were asking some of the jewelry so got these that we're dropping off today and and i'll pop in some pictures right here of some of the other pieces that I've sold so I'm hoping to be able to get them up online I just I have to look into the insurance about sending it across the border it is calling me. okay no I'm good or do you have it right now at your place yeah I do oh sure yeah okay I'll take those do you want to sure yeah. <laughs> okay, thanks. Okay. Okay. All right. I'll bye. see you in a bit. Bye. We're just leaving now. Bye. Okay, bye. Okay. Bye. My mom's saying cauliflower is on sale at Walmart, so <laughs> <laughs> I always get those calls. So she picks them up for me. <laughs> and she's gonna meet us at Kate's school so she can give me bananas and cauliflower. Alright, now we are off. What were you doing? Your nails? No. When did you do that? Last night? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, right. sorry guys. I'm uh, I'm late for uh, class because I was busy doing my nails. Thanks. Like, who are you? All right, now we are no, off. I was doing accounting. And it's... then tonight we have... All right, so like I was saying before my battery died... Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> it was Censoring Scott right now. Yeah, it's been a bit of a crazy day. Sorry about the sun. So right before we were off to riding less... Or right before my battery died. I was gonna say we are off to riding lessons tonight. On the way, <laughs> police stop us just as we're leaving because... Before we get into the video, go ahead and click the subscribe button and hit the bell to select all so you don't miss any of our videos. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and tell your friends and family about us too. It's the only way we can grow and that YouTube knows you're enjoying our videos. Be sure to follow us on Instagram and TikTok as well for extra content and behind the scenes footage. Let's get into the video. Police stop us just as we're leaving because there is a manhunt going on at home. I don't want it to know. She stopped thinking about yeah, it. She the whole way. in on uh, looking. Yeah, we're, we're a long ways away from the barn and so this whole drive I've been like, I hope they catch that person. I hope that they're not gonna be near our place. <laughs> but we have bear. And then right now we're coming up and we're on a stretch of road that you can't pass. So this guy is merging onto the road and tries to run us off the road because he doesn't want to be behind a horse trailer and then was tailing us and he's Past us now. unhappy with us. But we're hauling animals. Do better people. You can't just cut in front of animal trailers because we can't stop like that. It was our right of way anyway. Like we were on the highway and he's merging and trying to like five cars are trying to cut in front of us. Four of them got by, but he had to go behind us and he was upset about it. Anyway, as soon as it opened up, he beelined it past yeah, us. And, and now he's 15 feet in front of us. Yeah, all of that to get, <laughs> he's literally right in front of us. It's not worth causing an accident. Everyone just be calm. All right, anyway, we are almost there. So we will catch up with you in the barn. <laughs> Scott's got road rage right now. <laughs> I gave him a princess wave. What is that supposed to be? Because he's a little <laughs> Stop it! Oh my goodness. This is why I taught driving to Kate. Scott doesn't have patience or kindness to others when he's behind the wheel. He doesn't take well to people not driving nicely around him. All right, now we're almost there. She's a filthy mess. Look, it's so muddy at home right now because it's literally like spring, it's gorgeous out. It feels like April. Meanwhile, it's the beginning of February, but because of that, we've got so much mud at home. Everything's melting. You're very pretty. You'd be prettier if you weren't covered in mud. It's DVC something. Oh my God, this is disgusting. It can't be the cars. You live, like, you see cars. 
she senses something. Maybe she senses that guy's coming back. So that guy with the road rage literally turned off the road that he was heading on and followed us. What's up? It's like next level crazy when you're in such a rush that you're trying to cut people off and then you're so mad about it that you divert from your area that you need to go and <laughs> start following us. But anyway, luckily he turned around. Yeah, that needs a wash. So do you. <laughs> Look at all the mud on her. But when I give her a bath, I have to wash her probably five times before the water isn't brown. Yeah, she does hide it. Not as well today. <laughs> All right, let's get in. Are we done looking? Ignore her slightly choppy haircut because I only did the initial chop. It'll look better once it's fresh. Yeah, you need to I only clean did that up a little. Chop. I haven't evened it out. But her mane is so thick, it's hard to even it out properly. Yeah. Because it always changes like how it's sitting. But... All right. Okay, come on, pretty girl. <laughs> Drop in the comments. I'm going to put the GoPro on Kate again today. I think I figured out the adjustment I have to make to it. And drop in the comments below if you want me to post both versions of the ride. So the version from our point of view, seeing Kate riding, or from Kate's point of view on the horse, so that you feel like you're riding Stevie as well. Drop it in the comments below. Yay or nay to both versions getting uploaded so that you can choose your own adventure. <laughs> Yeah. Kind of different balance, right? We need to be prepared. 
prepared so we need to put in her corner that she doesn't change her rhythm, she doesn't change her tanner. Alright, sit up there, good ride right for her. We're going to circle once up here, then we're going to go right around the ring again. Give her a little tap, get her. Good, circle once. Flat survey to the inside, softer shot to the inside, and more to the side to the right. Good. And you got to really ride forward out of the camera. Really ride forward into this next corner to keep your inside leg up so it doesn't fall in. Better. Good. Good. Same to the next short end. Be really assertive riding out of that corner. But that inside leg stays on so it does not fall in. Nice. Good. And then drop when you're ready. Okay. Better walk. Pick your breath. Take her over cross country this summer. No, it's here. I normally refuse things, like she'll, like if she doesn't feel like, if she decides she doesn't want to do it, she'll like get there, she'll stop, and she'll be like, well, now I can do this, and then just like go at it and like, stand still. Yeah. But she refused the one once, and I pulled her away from the other one because she like ha kept half switching her lead. And was too focused on her lead to the, then the yeah. fact that there was a jump in front of and her. And then she was just out of balance and just couldn't. And I was like, we're just not going to do that. And, yeah, so yeah, and that's the right choice. Out. Don't present it if it's not right. No, because she had the video and I looked and she literally swapped her front lead like it was every other step. Yeah, which means she doesn't get it. She's back off. Because right? that was the first time we had an app to go cantering out of the ring. And she was just like, why are we cantering in grass though? Yeah. You guys haven't been here in the summer yet, right? No. So there's a bigger sand ring in the mine. It's, it's 100 by 200. Oh. So I'll set a jump course in that pretty much all summer. And then there's a big grass ring down there, which is, it's big. It's like a happy. Oh. But it's all fence. Like it's, yeah, it's pretty big. Yeah. So I'll set a course in that. And then there's cross country all around. Like right back to the hill of water complex. And then there's another sand ring up top that I put the dressage ring on. Oh, yeah. So as soon as we get to like good weather, I'll put the dressage ring out. So it lets us really stretch out and have lots of room for everybody who can come to spring, yeah. right? And handy to have two full jump courses set so we can sort of work around each other easily. Yeah. So, so she will definitely get her chance to jump on grass oh. with the full course and film and all the rest of it. So yeah. make sure she's paying attention, right? Back to this raised pole. They might want to go past the jumps, that's fine. Use 
use like two thirds of the ring. And then we'll come back to that skinny little ring and pull. Again, don't take the simple elements of the ring, right? See, you have a boulder straight, it's like a race, it's just a little bit out of the norm. Like on. Girl, we come back to that again. Again, you can straighten up a little more for me. Good. That's it. Good. Again, really keep in that bed, keep in that part. Okay, let's put her to the left hand. We're going to come back to the cavaletti right beside that pole. Okay, really good hand from the front. Organize it and then get there you go. Right back to that cavaletti. More energy than that. More impulsion than that. That's called her. Go right to the middle. Three, two, three, four. Turn to right. Get her. Oh, I don't know if that was straight when she landed though. Yeah, really hold that line out. They come in straight, they need to go out straight. Fine, back, come back to that again. Straighter anyway, she broke, but she was straighter. If the horse drifts over a jump or land on a different line than you took off from, you need to not push it evenly for their hind legs. Oh, that's harder like that. Give her a tap, get her on, she can come back to that again. And she broke instead of don't drop it again. She broke instead of sitting on her hind end and organizing her pelvic in the corner. You have to really set the camera on. Create energy and then sit up and balance it. Good, good. She'll be a little deep and she'll figure it out. That's better. There you go, good. And then drop your right. Like very few horses left for the right is truly man straight. Like most horses of my higher grip, they have no dominant hind leg. Right? So if her left leg is more dominant than her right, she's going to land off to the right. So we're sure. Which I suspect it is, because she doesn't want to get take up the left camera as much in the canter. The outside hind leg is the dominant leg. In the trot, it's the inside hind leg, the canter, and the outside. The outside hind leg is actually the first leg in the canter sequence. Let's trot her on, let's circle up here. Alright, let's get her on, let's come back to that top leg. First and foremost, you ride that canter forward. Then you set up the balance and come off the corner and get her to the middle step. That's fine. Get her, get her, get her, get her, get her, get her. We're going to pop over that travel and I'm going to go right around the ring and we'll pop over the black and play the cross trail going back and forth to the stable. Here your hands up, your left wrist up to stay straighter. Be a little deep, she'll fall, but good. Put handy with her feet when she has the iron. Heel down, right, rotate your toe in. Back to that cross rail again, and then I'm going to make it a vertical. You need 
need to keep the energy working through the exercise. Lots of energy, 
Lots of count. Lots of count. Good. Call. Call. Yeah, good. Four times. Here we go. Camera. Come back to this end. She's got to really, really move forward. Let the poles do some of the work for you. Gallop on. Let it go. No, not yet. Get her left. Come back again. Do a whole lot of side. Come back to this side again. And you want it again. Really have to move up. Lots of camera there. Let's go forward. You see her, she picks up that left fork. She's just not quite ready yet. We'll come through it again. Exactly. Take your circle up, get your camera. If it's not correct, she needs to wait get the camera up, get the forward camera. Canterly. She might be a little tired now to give it to me. We're certainly going to give it a good try. Right back to the side. Gotta go forward. There you got it. Good. Let her drop. Let her walk. Good girl. They're going to, even in a flying change, they do a flying change when they can end up off the ground. Right? All the holes do is give her a moment. Flex your ankle, try and make your leg longer. 
really stretch down around you. Yeah, that's good. Top hold up like a train. Take a little more left back. Good. Let's go a little bigger in the project. Good. A little bigger in the project. Curl. You got to go right around the ring. All right, push yourself a little more towards the middle of the saddle. So you get to kind of too much to the back. Right? And the more you can drop that heel down to that ankle, the more you can get your leg wrapped around her. Good there. Okay, good. Let her walk there. Good. And you feel when she actually like came in that that time. 